Hey kids, we've done another massive shot today, Sean and myself, and then this is Tasha's contribution. And while we're in at uh, Asda's having a nice cuppa and a quick break, we're going to go back and hit the shelves again. Hit the shelves again, strip the place. Yep. Um, Sean, can you tell me what the problems have been about making 160 food hampers? <laughs> Where do I begin to tell the story, story of how great a love can be? Um, not the easiest going in and stripping the shelves in Asda and Aldi and trying to then heave everything into the car. Yeah. Lifting 10 kilogram boxes of rice is quite a feat. And so thank God for Tasha's fitness. <laughs> yeah, and that, all my granny flaps gone. Yeah, okay. me too. Yeah. And, and then where are we taking it to? Because that was our other big bit, isn't it? Val? Bromstone. And we have completely mashed the room up because you can't get another bloody grain of rice in there. And so I'm, we've been told. I'm worried about 160 cabbages arriving there on Friday. Oh my God. But Sean, talk to us about that because you've sorted that out. Where did you get the cabbages from? Cabbages are from Rose Farm shop. Um, two cabbages for a quid, which I thought was really good going. God, yeah. And Monty's are also delivering um, eight 25 kilogram bags of potatoes, eight big bags of carrots, 360 apples and some clementines. Well, I hope he's delivering. But because what, if he doesn't, it's going we'll, to be we'll we're start. up. <laughs> Yeah. But what I'm excited about, so we're shopping local, you've gone direct Absolutely. to the farmer, the Absolutely. veggies are coming fresh off the field. Yes. And then, Val, what are we going to give the parents with the hampers? There's, um, she, Jenny's knocked up uh, seven recipes, so hopefully we can get them photocopied and put in there, because everything we put in the hamper will be um, the basis of these meals, so you just have to add a few bits to it to get yourself a full nutritious meal because Jenny's the nutritionist I would say at St George's Church Hall works for our kitchen and um, St George's Community Meal. Thank you so much ladies you're doing an amazing job. <laughs> Thank you.